Hi, my name is Asefe Shirafkan. What country do you come from? My birth country is Iran. How long have you been living in the United States? Uh, I left Iran in 1986, but since 1920, uh, 2004, I am living here in the United States. Okay. Okay. Were you raised in a particular religion? I was born Muslim, but I am non-believer Muslim. <laughs> so you had a revolution, an Islamic revolution in 1979. What was the connection between the uh, Islamists and the Marxists at that time? Um, at that time, we didn't see any connection, but now we do. Um, uh, also, the connection between uh, radical Isl uh, Islamic and the Democrats, uh, Democrat Party in United States. Democrat Party were supportive of the uh, radical Muslims, and they they funded and they helped them to uh, overthrow the kingdom in Iran. Um, for me, radical uh, Muslim, uh, communism, <laughs> socialism, they are all the same. They all sleep together. <laughs> and, and for me, they are all the same. <laughs> so how about today? What's the connection between uh, the Democrat Party and the uh, Islamic Revolution uh, primarily promoted from Iran? Okay. Um, there is an organization here in America. I believe they were established in 2002. The, their name is um, NAYAK, National Iranian American Council. They they claim that they they were established to bring peace between Iranian people and American people. But the reality is that they are lobbying for the regime, and Democrat Party, USA Democrat Party, also they are really supportive of Nayak. Um, the reason that I got involved. Um, uh, into uh -huh, activism is because uh, I want um, American people, Iranian people, Jewish, Muslim, all religion to know about Nayak. Nayak is uh, claiming that they are voice of Iranian Iranian people. They're the voice of Iranian people, but they are they are not voice of Iranian people. How many how many Iranians live in America today? Um, I'm not sure. I think in, in California about about one million. How many members are there to NIAC? Um, um, I think about 30 Iranian. 30? 30? 30? Uh, yes. Not even 100? No. Uh, I know. See, see what they did? They also um, brought American to participate in into their organization because they claim the purpose of this organization is to bring peace between Iranian people and American people and that's a big lie. They lobbied for the regime and then uh, Iranian Islamic official come to America for the UN gathering. They always go and meet them, throw a party for them. I believe they are funded by Iranian regime to to lobby for that. For example, right now they are fighting so hard to remove the sanction. They are also uh, what is I find it very dis disgusting. Um, they called Ghassan Soleimani uh, an Iranian hero, and for us he is not a hero. He is a terrorist, and and he he killed almost one million Kurds in uh, 1980s. So in Iran, so he's a, he's not a hero, and they call him hero. They fight so hard to remove the sanction, and Iranian people, they keep calling me, contacting me, and asking me, please contact White House. Don't remove. Ask President Trump not to remove sanction because they feel if. The, they 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 don't remove the sanction this regime will will be gone soon because they cannot survive um, 